Good evening. Welcome to our 18th annual National Honor Society induction ceremony. I am Ann Roaming, NHS advisor at RHS. I'm coming to you virtually from the PAC for our ceremony. When we began NHS, the first year that Rogers opened in 2003, 43 students were inducted. This year, 96 students are being inducted, a record for RHS. When these students are added to the existing members, Rogers NHS now will have 188 members, also a record. I'm looking forward to working with each and every NHS member. NHS is based on four pillars. Scholarships. Students in a minimum cumulative DPA of 3.50 or above to, re to receive an invite to apply. Character. How they present themselves on the field, on the court, or in the classroom, or just in general. Leadership. Have they shown leadership qualities on the field, on the court, or in the classroom? Service, giving back. Students need to do volunteer hours. In the age of COVID, this has proven to be very, very difficult, but students are finding ways to do this. I'd like to recognize our student executive officers for 2020-2021. Co-presidents, Caitlin Byrie and Bella Cornwolf. Co-vice presidents, Lauren Hatcher, Melissa Solom, co-secretaries, Olivia Hermanson and Mackenzie Turhar, treasurer, Anna Luxick, co-historians, Emma Stock and Lily Wade. I will now ask co-presidents, Caitlin Byrie and Bella Cornwolf to say a few words about their NHS years. Hi, I'm Caitlin. And I'm Bella. And we are your 2020-2021 NHS presidents. First off, we would like to congratulate each and every one of you on becoming an NHS member. Each of you were hand-selected to be a part of this program. It says a lot about who you are as a person to be a part of the National Honor Society. The pillars of NHS are scholarship, service, leadership, and character. All of you embody every single one of these pillars. This includes making the most of your educational opportunities, helping others, taking responsibility, valuing cultures, building relationships, and much more. First of all, NHS gave us a sense of community. We are able to become a part of this amazing family. NHS allows you to surround yourself with others just like you with the same drive and aspirations. This program is led by an amazing teacher who will go above and beyond to make sure you succeed. We also have a fantastic group of officers who are here to support you along your NHS journey. Second, National Honor Society allowed us to get involved in our community. Helping others has proven to be a really rewarding experience. We encourage all of you to step out of your comfort zone to help and work with others during your time as an NHS member. We want each of you to use the leadership skills we all know you have to impact others. Not only do we want to see this within your time as an at, here at RHS, but we hope you will use all the lessons and skills you learn from this experience for the rest of your life. And this program has done so much for the both of us and we hope it'll do so much for you. Make the most of this experience and then always push yourself to be the best you can be. Time goes by fast, so enjoy every minute. We already know each of you are great students and leaders, and we are so excited to see what you're going to do for this program. Thank you, Caitlin and Bella. Now comes the best part, where I read the names of all of our inductees. I want to apologize up front if I mispronounce your name. I'll begin with seniors, then juniors, and then sophomores. Our seniors are Remy Dar, Josie Henderson, Connor Raish, Joseph Roberts II, Ella Stratetsky, Lauren Tyson, Emma Wilson. Juniors are Axel Brezen, Jacob Clausen, Lauren Collier, Peyton Dane, Anna Doles, Avery Farrell, Mariama Bofana, Hannah Heimer, Brady Hummerding, Abigail Johnson, Madeline Johnson, Jamie Kirkfleet, Seth Kuhlman, Madeline 
Lynch. Jalen Newcomb. Bryn Rhinus. Allison Ritter. Alexis Rojas. Hannah Sharber. Peyton Schultz. John Seward. Isabel Smith. Haley Van Houten. Alexa Vukic. Jack Wayne. Ella Werner. Brandon Willingbring. Sophomores. Emma Althus. Rory Browning. Hannah Bruskovitz. Kaylee Carricker. Chase Cheslock. Caitlin Cornwell. Kylan Corrigan. Peyton Dawn. Taylor Dawson. Odin Eliason. Evan Engstrom. Emma Erickson. Olivia Fenstra. Madeline Gerberding. Clara Glad. Emily Glass. Gabriella Haddad. Bella Hoffarth. Bryn Hoffarth. Lily Holland. April Jonason. Remy Johnson. Annabella Kotke. Emily Kramer. Lauren Larson. Jasmine Leon. Madeline Luke. Sydney Mahler. Carly Martin. Madeline Meyer. Alexis Moberg. Tanner Moen. Joey Neighbor. Liam Nelson. Lucy Olenketo. Joy Olowu. Mackenzie Oswaski. Morgan Poyer. Riley Ramson. Carly Ryland. Alyssa Ringdahl. Caden Risbrut. Rachel Rivers. Olivia Rolick. Jackson Rowley. Dia Sanchez. Zachary Schott. Joanna Sherber. Abigail Schutz. Sydney Sharpton. Madison Shervin. Zoe Smith. Julian Sopland. Elizabeth Strickler. Samantha Sylvester. Nora Tomasau. McKenna Tierweiler. Brianna Volante. Jenna Vogt. Vanessa Vogt. Ella Wade and Leah Williams. I'm going to give you all a round of applause. A couple announcements. NHS meetings are every two weeks. They are virtual for now. The first meeting of each month will be a Google Meet, and the second meeting of each month will be a screencast created and run by Caitlin and Bella. The next meeting is tomorrow, October 13th. Everyone should have gotten two Google Meet emails from me. You can pick which meeting you want to attend, either 7.05 or 2.15, whatever works for your schedule. These meetings last five to 10 minutes max. There's always an attendance code for being present at these meetings. For the screencasts, you'll need to email either Caitlin or Bella to get the attendance code. We communicate through Schoology and Remind. I added everyone to the Schoology page, so please accept the page, the code. To figure out how to get everyone on Remind, information on Remind will be posted on Schoology over MEA break. Our first project for the year is Socktober. We are expanding our Socktober drive to include the whole school. Last year, NHS brought 
just brought socks and we collected 747 pairs of new socks that were donated to Cross. This year, we are asking the entire student body to donate new socks. They are, there are bins out in front of the main office that are labeled Socktober. I'm encouraging every NHS member to donate socks. T-shirt orders. An order form will be on Schoology for you to order shirts along with our shirt this year will look like and the cost. It is not mandatory for you to buy one, but I'm going to encourage all to do that. A few thank yous. Mr. Pars, I can't begin to even thank you for what you've done for leadership, for, NH for helping us with NHS and helping me plan this ceremony. Jessica Zobek, our head secretary, I'm indebted to her for mailing out letters for invites, helping plan the ceremony as well. Lauren Tyson, a senior at Rogers High School who was inducted tonight. She took all of our pictures for the slideshow and then Christine Iverson for being the technician to help me get through taping our virtual ceremony. Congratulations to all of our inductees. Thank you for joining us this evening. Email me, email me with questions and this concludes our ceremony.